Hey, Ty Miller here with Five Plan Partners. Uh, welcome to another Investors Insights educational vlog here. And uh, today I want to discuss annuities. So uh, annuities kind of get a, a bad rap in the uh, in, in the world sometimes. And I just want to you know clarify some things of what the three main types of annuities are and and why they're important to know. And so uh, let's just start with a basic definition of annuity. It's a contract between uh, you, the client, and, a, and an insurance company in which the company promises uh, to make periodic payments. And so a lot of times people get this to have income uh, generating when they retire uh, and, and replace that you know, retirement income that they may have. And so the three types of annuities are a fixed annuity, an indexed annuity, and a variable annuity. You know, these are important to know. A fixed annuity, you know, kind of can work in a couple different ways. It can be a, a glorified CD that you would get at a bank in a sense where maybe you give a company uh, money for a five-year time period and they promise to pay an interest rate. And at the end of that five years, uh, you would get your money back plus that guaranteed interest rate. Um, or they can also work in a sense of you give a company, uh, you know, the insurance company money up front and, and then they promise to make payments, a fixed amount of payments uh, for the rest of your life or for a certain time period. And so that's a unique aspect that fixed annuities have. They're typically uh, low or no cost um, and, and you know, typically used for income generation. A fixed index annuity or an index annuity is kind of a hybrid. It can work like a, uh, a true investment um, that's tied to a, a market index or, or it can have, uh, it also has downside protection that, that offers clients either fully or partially. And so that's kind of the unique thing about uh, the indexed annuity. Typically, again, you know, low cost or no cost. Um, but this time it gives you a little more upside than just a fixed rate of return. Uh, you know, could give you a certain market participation. Think of it like kind of choosing investments in your 401k. And, and so you have allocated to that percentage. And, and then all of a sudden, you know, once it gets to that certain number, they will cap you. So, you know, if the number is 10%, they say, hey, if the market's up 20%, we're only giving you 10. Uh, if the market's up eight, you're going to get eight. Uh, things like that. But they'll cap your upside. However, they will protect you on the downside, either fully or partially. Could be 25% or so, just depending on how the contract is structured. Uh, and then lastly, it gives us variable annuities. So variable annuities, um, you know, might be the ones that you kind of hear on the news that might be a little more expensive. They typically do have fees, uh, but they work like a ordinary investment where they're tied to a, a market or some kind of investment uh, where they will grow. Uh, they could offer some downside protection, um, but then you can also add uh, what we call riders onto these contracts, uh, which would provide you certain uh, income needs or, you know, protection, uh, you know, death benefits, things of that nature. And so one, you know, unique thing about annuities is the one time kind of in our industry, we can use the word guarantee. That's it's kind of a frowned upon word in our industry and for good reason. Um, but what can be guaranteed is, you know, in fixed annuities, the guaranteed rate of return that you have like a CD at the bank or the guaranteed amount of income that you can receive from the annuity. Once you start taking that income, uh, it can be guaranteed for a certain period of time or for your life. And it would be that same amount. Annuities, of course, aren't for everybody. It depends on your financial plan and your financial blueprint that we're more than happy to run for you. And, you know, it, it really just depends on your situation and, and you know, your kind of risk tolerance. And, and of course, they, they can be illiquid at times. So everyone's in a different boat when it comes to this, uh, just like any other investment. And uh, if you have any questions, please call us or email us and uh, we'll be here to help. Thanks.